Hello YouTube, this is Mass Production here and we're going to be doing a DVD update on top of the pool table. There is the 32 inch TV and the DVD player. And here's the couch and the chairs. I put the DVDs there. So here we go, let's begin. This is Seinfeld Season 1 and 2. I got that from a website for really cheap. Here's Seinfeld Season 9. So as you can see, I still need a lot more. Two, three, four. Yeah, you can figure out what I meant. That's season one, two, and season nine. I'm gonna get rid of the bigger box, bigger ones. Godfather. Uh, what we got here? This is the one, two, three, and the DVD collection and bonus material, which I haven't even watched yet. Next up is American Gangster, the three disc collection edition. As you can see, comes with a, comes like that, the case and the box. So you can either keep it like that and use this for something else, box for something else. It's, it looks pretty cool. And it comes with this too. In the book, which I don't even think I've ever really noticed it. So you got like two boxes in here. And off to the DVDs. This is a friend's DVD, but he never gave me my stuff packs, so I just kept it. And I don't talk to him anymore. It's just The Outsiders. I had to read this in middle school, and then they made me read this again in college. And I borrowed the movie so I didn't have to read the book. I ended up not even watching the movie or reading the book, but I still passed because I still remembered it from middle school. Miami Vice, Colin Farrell and Jamie Foxx. It's a good movie. A lot of action. I gotta clean that off. It's sticky there for some reason. Next up is Speed Racer. I haven't even seen it, but I just bought it because it's like $2 at Ross. I don't remember where I bought it. I think it was Ross. Next up, it's the only DVD I think, or one of the DVDs I regret buying, which is Date Movie. Uh, you can kind of figure out why if you've seen it. We got, I don't know, I always liked it, a lot of people didn't, it was Planet of the Apes. It's the two disc special edition. Uh, I don't think I've listened to this yet, this is the limited CD-ROM. It has a, it says right there, and you won't be able to see it. Get your paws on these exclusive prime packaged extras for the inside. Look at the upside down world playing apes. It, it's a hair raising adventure you won't want to miss. Prime packed extras included. The Forbidden Zone. What else? At the bottom just tells you what type of computer you need. Uh, this is DVD Rules the Planet. DVDs rule the planet. I don't know what this is. Hold on a second, guys. There's just more DVDs and I kind of ripped it up, so. Funny. It's hard to use one hand. I'm doing this. Next up is Tom Cruise, Mission Impossible 3. I got this with another movie, which I'll show you in a minute Predator 2. I don't know, I just like prior movies as you can tell on my other updates. I don't know if I have another DVD over here. AVP requirement. A lot of people didn't like it because of the darkness of it. I bought it to check it out for myself and yeah, they kind of screwed it up. If you watch the first AVP, you see a big difference. There's more light and there's more involved into it, more of a story to it. I forgot when I got this. This is the Tom Hanks' movie. Polar Express, a two disc wide screen edition. And there's the movie and there's the disc 2 the special edition, which I haven't watched yet. There might be a two part or a three part because I forgot what the limit of minutes you can have on YouTube. Next up is The Diary of the Dead with Georgia Romero. Good movie. All these movies are. Still got to buy some more.
Uh, next up is a case that's kind of destroyed. Let's disturb you. Every kid is next door to someone. That might actually be true. Because uh, a couple blocks away from me, somebody killed his girlfriend. I can't open it. He's got that stupid little tabs I gotta take off. So, maybe if I find a different DVD case, I'll replace this one so it doesn't look this bad. This is what we've gone over so far. This is the one that came with Tom Cruise's Thunder, which I haven't seen. I, was, I forget who was with me who bought it because it came with both. I haven't even seen Thunder yet. It's impossible 3 is alright. If anybody wants some movie review or anything on any of these movies, just leave a comment on the bottom. Next up is The Mummy, the animated series. I don't know if they had one, to be honest, but it wasn't that bad. I was still looking for the other volumes. I think there's two more or four. I don't remember at the moment. This is volume one. I've actually seen them all. I don't know if they made a video game for it yet. I wouldn't be surprised if they have. Next step is Late to Rest. I got this movie because of a YouTuber, cool dude, who recommended it. And it's actually a really good movie about a killer who video tapes his murders. If you want to know more about it, just watch Cool Dooter's videos on it. DVD updates. Next up is Spider Man 2, a widescreen special edition with the disc one and the special features. Predators, the newest one. I have this on regular DVD and Blu-ray. If you watch my other video, you know why. Plus, I like Predator movies. Next up, if you got a girl around or what, you got The Notebook. I've actually never seen this movie in my life. And I don't think I ever will, but unless, yeah, girl wants to watch it, I guess. Next up is probably one of the worst Chucky movies ever. The Seed of Chucky. Child Play. Uh, I heard they're making a remake of Child's Play, but I don't know yet. If they're going to go with it. Next up is Johnny Depp in Blue. I actually like this movie a lot. Johnny Depp is a good actor. I mean, he plays almost everything he can. Like the next movie coming up, Pirates of the Caribbean. The Case Curse of the Black Pearl. Sorry. I mean, he went from... He went from doing cocaine to a pirate to chocolate in the, the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. So, you know, he has a lot of, what's the word, a lot of talent. Rush Hour 2. I don't have the first one. I like the first two, I think, a little better than the third one, in my opinion. Next movie, it was stolen from me, so I had to replace it, but it was like two bucks, and it's Blade 2. I had all three, but they all got stolen, unless they're somewhere else, which I don't remember. It's, it's a lot of mess. This disc too. I don't know what's on it. Well, YouTubers, I'm going to be doing another update in a second. So just give me time and I'll have it up. Alright. Next video coming up. Bye.